First at 10, Halloween night has ended for many families at the Greene County's courthouse. Deputies scanning children's candy for foreign objects, including razors, nails, and other objects. Two News reporter Caroline Morse is live in downtown Xenia after speaking with families. Caroline? That's right, John. I've been speaking with families who say they've been coming here for years to the Greene County Courthouse to get their kids' candy checked on Halloween night. Many of them told me that it's almost become a new tradition to make sure their kids are safe. You know, times being what they are, you can never be too safe. Greene County resident Rob Smith says he brings his family every year to get their Halloween candy scanned to give him a peace of mind. Things have changed, you know, and, and you just want your kids to be safe, and uh, some people may take the opportunity to. To uh, make them unsafe. So we just stop by here every year for a fun thing uh, to interact with the deputies and, and get the, the candy check. Before tearing into candy, many families ended Halloween night here at the Greene County Courthouse to make sure their goodies were safe to bring home. Now, before long, an object caught a deputy's attention, something a little girl said she didn't know was in her bag. I called a snap bracelet. I don't know what it's called. Okay. But it just snaps into a bracelet. But and you found that in the there. Screen. It showed up on the screen, looked suspicious. So we checked it out a little bit further just to make sure it was safe. Her mother, Brittany Long, says times have certainly changed and she doesn't go home Halloween night anymore without getting her children's candy checked. Honestly, crazy to me that somebody would want to hurt a child. Um, I just think that people need to be more aware that, you know, people are out there to hurt their kids and they need to take the extra precaution to get their kids' candy checked on Halloween. Now, if you didn't have time to come by tonight to get your candy scan, don't worry. The courthouse will be open from 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. tomorrow, where you can once again scan your Halloween candy. Live in Xenia, I'm Caroline Morse. Two News working for you.